guys it's your girl angelica and welcome back to the channel so as y'all can see behind me what's going on happy thanksgiving because by the time y'all see this video it will be thanksgiving so as y'all know we gotta prep and get all this stuff good and ready okay so first thing first we gotta get with the turkey so as y'all can see right here behind me we got the turkey right here that's been soaking in some vinegar and water and i actually scrubbed it with some lemons got her right there this one is bigger than this one, okay? So I'm about to butter them up real good and get them in the oven, actually. I'm going to cook them about 95, like about 90, 85% of the way. And that way, when they get tomorrow come, it'll not be nice and fresh and won't be dried out. Okay, y'all. So then what I already did, I'm going to show y'all a clip of um, me making, uh, me doing the cabbage. I actually cut up the cabbage, did that already, that's in the refrigerator. Then here, we got all the sweet potatoes that we done peeled over here. Right here, I have my lovely daughter helping me say thank you. And um, she putting the peelings inside the sweet potatoes. Okay, you wanna say hi, baby, to everybody? Hi. Yes, okay, so this is what we doing right here, y'all. We got all this already done. Well, I was doing my makeover. Okay. <laughs> Don't touch my food. I don't know where your hands been at. Okay, y'all. So let's do a check. Let's do a check off. So we got the turkeys going. We got the sweet potatoes peeled and cut. Now we doing the um, mashed potatoes. I'm making homemade mashed potatoes. So I got our yellow slicing the um, the, just the uh, the peelings off of those. I'm not gonna boil them just yet. I'm gonna just go ahead and leave them whole. Then I'm gonna boil them. And then mash them up and put everything in and put all the goodness up in there, whatever, whatever, you know. Then I got the brisket already um, marinating. I use, let me show y'all what I use for that. So for the brisket, y'all, I use some of this right here, this butcher's all-purpose seasoning. I use some of this um, liquid smoke right here. I also use some onion powder, some garlic powder. I put some minced garlic in it, y'all. A little bit of um, the Himalayan salt and um, some onions. Yep. So when I put, so that's where we at in the process. I'm actually waiting for my mom to come because she's gonna finish cutting up the sweet potatoes for the pies. All these sweet potatoes that you, this is all gonna be sweet potatoes, just regular sweet potatoes. Okay, because I want to make two of everything. Because if y'all. In my last video that I posted when me and the kids had went out, it was like a little vlog, get ready with me, vloggy vlog. Um, we act, I actually let y'all know that my daughter Naisa's birthday is actually November the 25th, but we're celebrating it on the 24th with Thanksgiving. It's going to be a Western theme, so stay tuned for that as well. So what I'm doing right now is I'm about to cut up these three pieces of celery, which is going to be used for the stuffing that we got over here. Cut up this celery. I'm going to cut up some onions. Um, we also have some jasmine rice as well that I'm going to cook as well. And we have a couple other family members who are bringing others. Hey, so I just wanted to come on here right quick because I had to transfer all the sweet potatoes into another bin because it was so many. Look, y'all. Look how many sweet potatoes this is. My God. This is a lot of goddamn sweet potatoes. But, yeah, this is how we move and this is how we... Yeah, we're going to need like a whole like 10 pound bag of sugar for all these goddamn sweet potatoes. I hope mommy bought enough. Yes, y'all. I just wanted to show y'all that right quick. All right, I'll be back. So y'all know I had to get back on here. My D baby just walked through the door. That's who birthday I was um I was going to in Philly. Look at my favorite little person. <laughs> yes, y'all. So I just had to do that right quick. All right, now I'll be back. All right, y'all. So I'm back. So now I wanted to show y'all what I... What I base my turkey with, in case y'all was wondering. All right, y'all. So this is what I use. I go ahead and I use this um this garlic and herb butter right here. I got I got another one in there, but these is all the sticks of butter right here with fresh cilantro, and then I normally put a little bit of slap your mama on that. Um, a, a, some slap your mama, some onion powder, garlic powder. Um, I'm gonna use a little bit of this Dino's this time. I normally don't, but this is something that I tried and I think I like it a little bit. So I'm gonna put some of that on there. I also put a little bit of Obey on there. I got another one 
and also some seasonal the flex seeds right here that y'all see these flex chi hip seeds i like to put these in like my cabbage stuff that you can like kind of like you know put it in and not not really be noticeable but yes you gotta stay healthy some way somehow make sure we get the healthy and the good stuff in there so yeah i use that and um i think that's about all that i really use Today is actually Thanksgiving. Happy Turkey Day to everybody, y'all. So, um, I'm basically, we basically done. So, let me just show you what we had so far. All right, y'all. So, we got both of the turkeys done right here, y'all. I'm going to give y'all a nice little, yeah. Ma, what's this right here? Green. Okay. So, we got the turkeys and the greens done. I'm actually putting on some turkey bacon now, y'all, for the, um, for the cabbage that I showed y'all yesterday. Let me turn this fan off so y'all can hear me. So yeah, I'm about to go ahead and put some turkey bacon and the grease inside of this uh, cabbage. And this how much left of the cabbage mix that I got. Um, we got the pies already done over here, y'all. Let me show y'all. Look y'all, them pies looking real, real good. They are the sweet potato pies. I actually made an upside downwards cake, y'all. I'm hoping and praying that it comes out right. So let's cross our fingers. But yeah, y'all, here go mommy. Yeah, hey, good morning. Happy Turkey Day, y'all. <laughs> yes, y'all. So we about to go ahead and get to it, and then I'll be back. Just cut it. I can cut and just put all the dark you like me. Y yeah, something like that. Yeah. yeah. All right, y'all. So. Um, the cake turned out pretty good, y'all. This is my first time making this cake, so look, y'all. Ooh, I hope the lighting good for y'all, y'all. Look at that. This is a strawberry cake with almonds, brown sugar, white sugar, and honey. No, I don't think there's no honey on there. But baby, she looking good. So make sure y'all comment down below what y'all think. But all right, y'all, I'm trying to wrap this up because I want to really be cut, done cooking everything by like one o'clock so i can go out and do what i need to do so now we on to the mashed potatoes so i'm gonna show y'all how i make my mashed potatoes all right so i start off with boiling my mashed potatoes until they you can stick a fork through them i like to add sour cream i'm adding parmesan cheese i add some salt i'm adding some also some garlic butter and some pepper with a little bit of milk and yeah, so I'll see you guys when I get back. Okay, y'all, so now we are on to the stuffing. So we stuffing, as I showed y'all earlier, this is actually some Italian turkey sausage with some butter. I actually added some onion powder, some poultry seasoning, some sage, some black pepper, some garlic powder, and some slap your mama and then we got the onions and um celery about to saute that and then we're actually going to use the juice from the turkey as a um liquid so that's what's going on now y'all so that's how i make my stuff in so yeah i'll be back when we get it on and popping Hey, what's up guys? I'm back. So now I'm about to make the last and final thing. It is 5.30. Dinner is at 6. Look, they go nephew. Hey. So now I'm about to make the mac and cheese with everybody love on Thanksgiving. Okay. So first thing first, I got some mild cheddar cheese. Boom. Then I have some mozzarella. I have three things of mozzarella. I have three things of the triple blend. I have some sharp cheddar and some goa cheese as well that i'm going to put in there y'all and then i'm going to use some heavy whipping cream some milk and these seasonings slap your mama just a little bit 
onion powder, garlic powder, pepper, and a little bit of um, carnation milk as well. So yeah, I just wanted to show y'all how I make my mac and cheese and of course butter. And yeah, I see y'all once everything is done probably. And I, because this is the last thing. So yeah, after this y'all, I'm getting dressed and I'm heading out the door. Next. I just had to come back and let y'all see this cheese sauce though. OMG. Look at her. That goodness. That goodness, baby. It's a lot of cheese. Look, some of it, that Goya cheese is still trying to melt. But I got it down real low. Because I already burnt some of the cheese, y'all. Because I had it up too high. Like but yep, that was all. So, so as y'all can see, it's later on in the day. And we finished everything. So I'm about to give y'all a little tour right quick, right quick. All right, y'all. So this is the punch station slash cake station slash everything look at this cake my neighbor brought over looks good yes baby yeah what what do you got Took that all yes, you did. Off. You took that motherfucker apart. Okay. <laughs> oh, they just some um cookies that she um that she made.